hello everybody welcome back to another chapter of the high school update today we'll be talking about best friends in the world and it's going to be like a chat room stay tuned moreover don't forget to subscribe like and then comment as well once again i'm tracy friends and i'm your host i thought i'll see your mom ah, she'll be home late she's at a dinner with a friend's family how long are you staying sarah i'm not sure yet but i'll decide to enjoy every second this was a really nice Christmas surprise. Right? Boucher, <laughs> hotline bling. Who's been texting you since? Oh, you guys know Evelyn, right? Which Evelyn? Evelyn? Adam's childhood friend. She got to you too. Whatever she says, don't believe her. Uh, what have you done? I may be kind of... Accidentally told her that we are having a low key Christmas party and she could come. <laughs> Wait, what's wrong? Sarah, we are not exactly friends. <laughs> Call her right now. Call her and tell her that you made a mistake that she isn't invited. Oh. I'm sorry, guys, but she just texted to say she's already here. Should we run? Run where, Olive? This is your house. Oh. <laughs> Hello everybody, as I already said, to the chat room of the high school update, I have a sister, a friend, <laughs> and then have a girl here with me, so please would you like to introduce yourself to me? Hi everyone, I'm Alicia Tufona, I'm from the Asantua Girls in High School. Wow, Alicia. Oh, Marco <laughs> Pojo. Okay, so have you watched the season 10 of the best friends in the world? Probably. Yeah. How do you feel? How was it? Oh, um, my observation is that um, so far I have nothing more to say. It's it's just it's just nice. Oh, okay. But to the rest. So who is your favorite character? Oh, I think Maria. Why is Maria your favorite character? <laughs> oh, Maria is someone. She just kind-hearted and looking at how things went for her when she came to the school although it was tough for her but she was able to condole so i just like her <laughs> do you think olive is right by not admitting her feelings to adam uh i think yeah she's right to right me. in what way you see boys are some way Based on something like how I don't understand. Yeah. <laughs> Immediately, maybe you are, you have feelings for him and you just admit and tell him. Some will be bossy over you. But at this time, Adam told Olive that he lied her already. So why shouldn't Olive admit it? I think because um Olive thought of her uh, academics, so and it's it's a little disturbance. I don't think the belief is selfish. Oh, I think so, but you know, just her own choice. So, okay. How do you see Esther as well? Is it okay for her to separate from the two friends in this time they have issues? For me, that's the right thing. Yeah, because you being together with friends and right now, they are not talking. You have to find a way just to let them talk so is she using the right approach <laughs> see there are many approaches but she's she's just trying she's trying sure yeah. okay now to bossy iris <laughs> is she trying to really get close to her sister this time because it seems for now she has changed see how she complimented um her sister Oh, Iris. Iris is kind of. She's a little bit disrespectful, but I ah. think 
she's been real in this episode. <laughs> Iris is nice. Iris is nice too. I I really like Iris, but I, <laughs> um, she's having some character in here. It's not just nice, but maybe she know. just wants to stay boss because you see juniors these times they <laughs> want to respect me. Oh, you know, you see, prefership. Prefership is something that you just have to comply to the rules. Because, for instance, if you are a head prefect, you just have to make sure everything is in right order. So are you a prefect in your school? Oh, probably. <laughs> in class, um, I am. So are you bossy on them? Or how do you relate? Oh, um, I'm a kind of friendly person, but you know, if you if you try to joke with me, you won't take it easy with me at all. So, but all the same, I'm, tr I'm trying to do my best with my with my class people. Okay, sure. You talk with your mommy that much? Yeah, probably. But <laughs> my As in how um Olid shares things with her mother. Oh, my 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 mom is kind of busy. So so far, my siblings especially. My elder sister. So, what do you have to say out there to those that don't share their secrets with their mommies? Because you see, only the mother is kind of supporting. No, do you know something? You are trying to meet something here. Oh, <laughs> because I've already told you, um, my mom is kind of busy, so I talk to my sister a lot. So, advice mm -hmm. to parents. Advice to parents. I think parents are to be just. Um, time conscious when it comes to their children, they have to just have time for their children so that if anything at all, like they are facing any circumstance, they can just, just bring it out. Oli is dropping and then the mother is trying to encourage <laughs> yes. you. Yes, I really like Oli, Oli, Oli's mother. Sure. She's very supportive. Would you be happy if Oli's mother dates Kelvin? The bank <laughs> manager or something? Um, you know why? Because see, if women or girls, if we are supposed to do such things, and it's like you see, um, if Olive was supposed to be small or young, let me say that way, it would be probably okay. But this time around, Olive's mother. Has his or uh, her own um job, so you think it's not okay? I yeah, uh, it's it's not okay. So it's just fine for her to just take of Olive. Okay, sure. Something small you've learned from this series, best friends in the world, to our people watching you right now. This very episode or the whole anything, yeah. any advice, something small. Oh, I was just say that we shouldn't jump into conclusions which you got from which character um so far olive yeah olive oh, how and um, when maria came to the school oh yes yes and what she did wasn't nice so we should try and just investigate about something so that we won't just Fade away. Sure. Yeah. So it was nice having a talk with you oh, on too. this show. You too. So let's go for a commercial break. We'll be right back with another wonderful guest. <laughs> Have you two finally made up? No. no. How can you proudly say no? I'm still waiting for your apology. Well, I'm not ready to give it. Can someone just apologize so this stupid fight will end? That won't solve the problem. But it's a step in the right direction. Then fine. I'm sorry. I'm sorry too. Esther, Esther wait. Welcome back to the high school update chat room. We have another guest here with me and then he is... I'm Rafael Asamoa. But I prefer being called Sagashes, and I'm from St. Hubert Minor Senior Senior High School. Okay, so we strike. St. Hubert. Ah, they're pastors. No, we don't pastors. We don't pastors. Okay, so how do you see this episode? So, 10 of 
the senior year. Of yes, the senior year. Well, it was awesome. And then it had a lot of, you know, things which you could learn from. Mm. Yeah, a whole lot. And it was fun too. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Only with the thing. <laughs> so, who is your favorite character? In the whole of the movie. The yes, history. in episode 10. Let's see, in episode 10. In every episode, I'll go for Romeo. Why? Because one, he's funny. Mm -hmm. And you can't really see through him. You can't see what he thinks. Or, like, the guy is cool. Yeah. Okay, so Romeo, thumbs up. <laughs> <laughs> so, you have a sister? No, I just have a brother. Okay. Little brother. Yeah, Chris. Okay, so, what would you have done if you were in the shoes of Romeo? Mm -hmm. Yes, and then your sister or your brother went out to steal. You had to apologize, being embarrassed, and then you are there as a senior. Then and then children are like your sister is this, your sister is that, or your brother is this. Since you have a brother, okay. So it's the same that when you get to the bridge or when you get to the the, the river, you know how to cross. Right now, I don't have any sister, but taking into consideration some things, I think. How Romeo handled that issue was great because in the first place he's trying and um, he's he's working really hard to cater for his sister yeah. and any other any other person. Yeah, so how he went about it was very great. He he didn't become so angry to the extent of maybe hitting my sister or something. She just he just coped and understood what and was so, so how cool. do you see the sister as well? Gloria. Gloria, Gloria, I hated her from the beginning, yes. Yes, because how can your brother be shy when they are braggart? Braggart, she's a braggart. <laughs> she's so bossy, even though, let's say, she has life, so she has something that you don't really have anything, yes. but you're a braggart. And I hate, I hate people like that, yeah, so. But now I think she's changing. Yes, so she's it's okay she. now. Yeah. Don't you think it's because she was caught or something, that's how? Sometimes you don't have to be caught before you change. Yeah, you don't. Else, when you're not caught, you didn't know what you were doing actually. And so, it's. I think it's because she was caught and then she realized the mistakes. So you think um, Adam is okay in this episode? Because as a young man or as a gentleman, if there's something between you and ladies, you have to just come mature. Mm -hmm. As you have been like, let's sit down, let's do this. But then Adam is being too naive for me. Like, yeah, Adam. Yes. Adam lacks any knowledge. Like Adam is really naive. That's the truth. Adam, we are sorry. <laughs> oh no, I am sorry. He's naive. That's the thing. But he he doesn't he doesn't really think through a lot of things, and it's like he thinks as a child, something like that. Sure. I know he doesn't. It's just in the movie. Yeah. yeah. So he thinks like a child in the movie. So how he goes about his things are very in the naive manner. So I I, I don't buy. What of Olive? Olive also thinks. Olive is also stuff. childish, but not as naive as Adam is. But both of them, it's like they hiding behind stuff. Like Olive one has a lot on her mind, like dwindling in terms of her academics and other things. And then Adam is also stuck between choosing between Evelyn and then Olive. So they all have a lot on their minds, but they aren't going with that. Anymore. Like they aren't doing the right, you know. I smell something fishy between Robert and then Maria. Okay, in this episode. Robert is never a gentleman. It's like today Robert was dancing B A. <laughs> Robert. Yes. Yes. Robert is also one of my favorite guys in that movie. Eh. Yes. But in this episode, I can't really say a lot because nothing has happened yet. They are just talking. Yeah, they dance. They dance. They danced, but ah, but then Robert was being a gentleman. See, see how Robert was dancing. Have you it's ever because seen Robert before? is always moving with Adam. No, 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 the guy. Robert is always moving with Adam. Robert <laughs> had okay. Let me say this. I think Robert likes Maria. That's yes, the truth. yes. But yes. in this episode, nothing has happened yet. So we are so waiting. We are waiting for episode eleven, episode twelve to see something. You know. Okay, so I have a crush in this movie. Mm -hmm. It's called Achi. What do you think Achi. about my crush? Achi. Yes, Ashi Ashi is very mature. Yes, right. he's matured. He, How you even said you look beautiful. Everything, then, everything about Archie is just perfect. Like it's okay, everything. Ah. 
Everything is on points with him. <laughs> okay, and then what of Daniel's brother? Sorry, Adam's brother, Daniel. Daniel. Daniel is a good brother. Sometimes he inspires me. Since I have just a brother, he inspires me to do some things with my brother. So you learn from a lot from Daniel. Him, a lot, a whole lot. Especially when he lets Adam think for himself. Yes. He always does that, like let him let him Adam think for himself, even, even though he helps him. But yeah, he's very good. I like Daniel. Yeah. Okay, sure. Something small you've learned from this episode, let's say some mm -hmm. advice to our people watching us. From this very episode. Okay, first and foremost, I'll talk about um, um, Olive's costume. Yes. <laughs> Olive linked it to academics. Yes, know? history. Yes. So, first of all, I'll, I'll say that everything, everything, being it um, party, like going out, everything can link with academics. So, you should try and then link it to academics somehow, like Olive did, even though. Yeah, and then go ahead the, the, the winner or something. Yes, go ahead the winner. Yes. So that's one thing. So you should always keep on learning. Yes, exploring. Because yes. she said she got gold mm -hmm. and then found on it. On some woman. Yes. Yeah, I forgot the name. Hey, and then another thing. Um, Esther. Esther. I think Esther has been a good friend here. A yes. very good friend. Leaving the two other friends to, you know, think settle. of their faults, settle, and then bringing them together, like, Esther is also a good friend, and then so we we out there. We should also be friends, like good friends too. Be good friends, people. so yes. When you're having a fight, don't go with one crazy. Good friends. Very oh, good. And then also about this guy, um, Romeo. Yes, Romeo is always calm about everything, like everything. So you shouldn't rush into doing some things. You should think through a lot of things before you do them. You shouldn't just. Take actions, yeah. So, for me, so if I'm to talk about what I've learned, it's a lot. So, let's just so yeah, best yeah. friends in the world is a whole package. Yes. You should continue watching them, yes. the whole package because I kind of get lots of vocabulary students. That's mm, yeah. yes, I had this merch and other yes. things. <laughs> see, when you are yes, writing something, yeah, don't really. just only gave me a lot of vocabs, yes, a lot. Don't just be watching it, it's educative. So, this ends our chat room today. Don't forget to continue watching Best Friends in the World. Follow us on IG and then subscribe to our YouTube channel. Like and comment as well. Once again, I was your host, Tracy Friends. Thank you all. Oh, yeah, education at its best with entertainment. Campus Live High School News Only on High School Live <laughs>